Hey, Matt Wolf here again with another little marketing tip, trick, tactic, hack, whatever you want to call it. Uh, today, I want to talk a little bit about how to download videos off of other people's pages. All right, so when you go to somebody's sales page or opt-in page or whatever, and it's got a video on it and you actually want to download it, I'm going to show you how to do that. Uh, now, why would you want to download it? Well, two reasons that I can think of specifically. One is for your own personal swipe file. Me personally, I actually have a folder here on my desktop called Swipe, and I actually keep screenshots of Facebook ads, funnel breakdowns, uh, various snapshots of, of pages. And then I also have a video swipe where when I find sales videos or opt-in videos or any or upsell videos or anything like that, that I think do a really good job. I like to download them, save it in my video swipe. And then when it comes time for me to make a sales video or an upsell video or an opt-in page video, I refer to my swipe file for sort of inspiration on, uh, on, on making that sales video. So that's one reason. The other reason is if you want to download it and speed it up, watch it in your own player. So um, a lot of times I'll land on some of these video pages and I'll download the video and then open it with a player like VLC, which allows me to rapidly speed up the videos. Uh, now in one of my previous videos, I showed you how you can speed up the videos watching it right online. But if you want to save it, watch it in an offline, you know, watch it offline without uh, seeing it on the website, without the video having to buffer, that sort of stuff. Um, you can use a tool like VLC to speed up the video playback. All right. So now this is one of those things that, you know, I might get some flack for showing you how to do it. A lot of people don't want you snagging their videos off their sales pages, but um, you know, I'm going to demonstrate it anyway. I'm going to demonstrate it with one of my videos. Again, this is just so you could kind of get a sneak peek inside of how other people are doing their marketing and have your own little swipe file and that sort of thing. All right. So here's how you would do it. Now you might need to follow along pretty close. Um, it's not the easiest thing in the world to do if you've never done this before, but you have to use Google Chrome uh, as your web browser that I know how to use it in Google Chrome. Um, and you're going to go ahead and right click, click on inspect. All right. So we're going to go ahead and inspect this document. All right. The next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to hit command and F and that's going to bring up this little search box down at the bottom left of my uh, inspector window. Now, if you're on a PC, I think you hit control F, but everything should be the same beyond that. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna type dot MP4, because most of these videos are MP4 files typically. And uh, you can see it found MP4 listed a few times here. And what I wanna do is I want to select this video file here. I'm gonna go ahead and select this one, and I need to select this entire URL here that has this MP4 on it, even beyond this question mark. If I just try to copy this here, I'll get an error message when I try to load the video. So I'm gonna select this entire video link here, but then also select all this sort of jargon after it that says token equals blah, 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 blah. Everything all the way up until the next quotation mark, okay? So starting with the HTTPS, all the way to this quotation here, I'm gonna copy this entire MP4 file. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit Command C, and that's actually gonna copy it to my clipboard, Command C. So just to recap, I right clicked, clicked Inspect, did a Command F, typed in .mp4 to find the MP4 file for this video, and then I selected the entire URL here, all the way through the MP4, the question mark, token equals all the jargon after the token, all the way up to the quotation mark here. And then I hit Command C to copy it. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open a new tab in Chrome up here. I'm gonna right click and paste that URL right into Chrome. All right, and this is gonna bring up the video file. You can see now the video file is on a standalone page here in Chrome, and it becomes real simple after this. I could right click on the video, click Save Video As, and just save it to my desktop. This is a designer promo video. So I'll go ahead and save it as designer promo video. Click save. It will now download this MP4 to my desktop. You can see right here, I've now got it on my desktop. I could drop it into my swipe folder on my desktop so I can review it later, or I can right click, open with VLC. This is the tool I use to watch videos on my computer. Now I can play this video back go up to playback in VLC, 
boost up the playback speed and watch the video as fast or as slow as I want to watch the video. And uh, I have some, you know, I have options now. All right, so just another little cool little tip trick to to sort of build your swipe file and keep your finger on the pulse of how other people are doing their marketing so you can get some inspiration for your own marketing in the future. Hopefully this video was helpful for you. I'll see you guys in another one.